What's up guys, it's Tommy here and in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to import videos from your Mac or MacBook onto your iPhone camera roll. It's a very simple process and I'll show you guys how to do that right now. So the first thing you're going to want to do is go into the App Store. You're going to be downloading an app called Documents. So go ahead and go to search and then search Documents. Okay, so once you have searched documents, this should show up. It's the first one. It should look like this. It's called Document 5 File Manager PDF Reader. So go ahead and install that app. Alright guys, so once the app has actually downloaded, go ahead and open it up. It should look like this, by the way. Okay, when you first open it up, I think it's going to ask you something about an email. Just on the top right, just hit later. Uh, and then you should come up to this page right over here. So it's going to say iPod library, iTunes files, and photos. The only ones you really want to mess with is the iTunes files and the, fo the photos folders. Okay, so um, if you click on it, it's going to ask it's gonna ask you um, to allow access. So put OK. And now it's going to um, have access to your photos. So you're going to want to do the same thing to the iTunes folder. Uh, just go ahead and click on it. If it asks you to allow access, just put OK. If not, then you're good to go. Okay, so the next thing we're going to want to do is go on to the, your Mac. So plug in your iPhone into your Mac. I'll be back once I have done that. Alright guys, so once you've connected your iPhone or whichever device you're using to your Mac, let it go ahead and sync and back up. So now mine's already finished, but I'm going to show you guys one quick thing. If you're trying to get a video from iMovie, you're, you are going to have to um, export it. Now to do that, you're going to have to go to this little uh, button on the top right of iMovie. It should look like this. So go ahead and click on it. And then go by file. Once you click on that, you'll get this screen right here. You can go ahead and name it or whatever you want. What you want to do is hit next on the bottom right corner. And then it's gonna ask you where you want to export your file. And you can just put it on your desktop or wherever you want. So yeah, I just want to show you guys real quick how to do that if you were trying to get a video from iMovie onto your iPhone camera roll. But anyways, so once you have whichever video you want on your desktop or you can put it wherever you want, the next thing you're going to want to do is go into iTunes, click on your phone, go to apps right under summary. Once you clicked on app, go ahead and scroll down until you see file sharing. And then it's going to give you a list of apps. Then click on documents, the app that we just downloaded earlier. Click on that. Once you've clicked on the documents app, uh, scroll down a little bit and then on the bottom right, you should see the add button click on the add button and then you're gonna find the video that you want to be added to your camera roll alright guys so we're gonna go ahead and use this video so once you found the video you want to choose click add it is gonna go ahead and copy actually yeah let it copy first and then once that's happened uh, you'll see it show up right here and then click done and now it should be on your device all right, guys. So now that we've imported the video into the Documents app, you're gonna have to, you're gonna want to go ahead and open it up. Go to iTunes file, and then you're gonna see your video right here. So what you're gonna want to do is on the top right, it's gonna say Edit. Click on that. Click on the little bubble on next to your video, and it should check mark like that. So once you've done that, on the bottom, you're gonna want to hit Move, and then now you're gonna decide where you want that video to be moved to, and it's gonna be photos if you want it to your camera roll. Go ahead and let that uh, process and then it's going to open everything in your camera roll. Just hit move and it's going to go ahead and begin to move the video to your camera roll. And then it's going to say the folder is empty since you've moved it now. So now we can go back and check the camera roll to see if it actually moved it there successfully. So here's the video. It is. It has been moved. This is the video we transferred and yeah there it is. What's up guys, so I just want to show you guys real quick uh, another way to do it if you have a Mac that I believe is a 2012 version or later. You can actually airdrop your video onto your um, iPhone or whichever device you're using. This is actually a lot easier. However, my Mac is a 2011 Mac, so I actually can't do this. That's why I used the, uh, the previous method I just showed you guys. But if you do have a newer Mac, you can definitely do it this way. Click on the video that you want to be airdropped, right click, 
and then go down to where it says share and then it's going to give you the option to airdrop which is this one right here click on that and then this window should show up now the only thing is you're gonna have to make sure that you do this on your Mac and then also make sure that the airdrop is on for everyone on your iPhone and then you should receive the video that way if you have any questions feel free to comment below I'll go ahead and answer them to the best I can and I'll see you guys in the next video don't forget to subscribe peace